we, we're here just to see what you're doing and to taste the dish and look at the dish what you put off. You know, that, that, that's what we're here for, and, we, and we, we, we'll judge it on the fact of what it tastes like, what it looks like, and that's it. It's not, you know, it's just like a day, a day at the office, you know. They practice huh? when they want to do something, you know. You know, you've got to practice and you've got to find out the faults so that you can improve, and that's what it's all about improving. That's why you're here today uh, to improve. Uh, but thanks for all your efforts, uh, it was good. Like I say, you need to keep looking at the basics and working on the basics all the time and practice. You know, you need to take the ingredients and work with them. And the more you work with the ingredients, then the, the more your cooking skills will improve. But uh, you know. Right. Might as well announce who's going through it. Yeah, well, the two going through to final are uh, Leslie and Jamie. <laughs> Jamie. <laughs> My name's Jamie Wakeford, I'm from Glasgow, I'm 25 and I work at Cameron House Hotel with Walkman. I'm Leslie and I'm 22 years old and I work at Walking House Hotel Engine. It would mean a lot because it's the prestige you get from it and obviously it, it shows you that um, you're good. And it's not often that you get compliments and thanks my kitchen, to be completely <laughs> honest. Um, winning to me would mean a lot because you worked hard. You work really hard every day in the kitchen. And like you said, you don't get a lot of, oh, well done, oh, that's good. It's just constantly getting shafted, basically. So, <laughs> so when you win something like that, you get a bit of recognition. You see yourself in the paper. And it's good to, it's, it's giving something back to you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 